Similar to how high blood pressure can cripple you with a heart attack, high oil pressure can cause your car to have a long list of issues. Your car's oil serves many purposes, but all of them depend on the right oil pressure. But what exactly is high oil pressure? What does it do and how can you tell that's what's going on? And just before we start, please ensure you've subscribed to the channel. What is high oil pressure? In order to lubricate, clean, seal, protect, and cool your car, engine oil passes through tiny openings and channels throughout the vehicle. However, the pressure on the oil increases as these channels narrow. Maintaining the proper level of oil pressure in your engine is crucial because excessive pressure can cause various parts to wear out and become damaged. Common Causes of High Oil Pressure There are a few specific areas you check to try and find the cause even though high oil pressure is a very serious issue. Here we've broken down the top five. Clogged or blocked filter. A clogged, damaged, or blocked oil filter is one of the most frequent reasons for high oil pressure. Although this usually only occurs when your oil filter is very old, it can also occur if something comes up and strikes it while you're driving and if this is your issue, the good news is that it's a fairly simple fix. All you need to do is change your oil and replace the filter and you should be set to go. Old or wrong oil. Oil becomes less viscous with time, which makes passages more difficult for it to pass through. If enough time passes, it may even turn bad. This raises the oil pressure naturally, which may cause issues for your car. Furthermore, not all oils are made equally, therefore high oil pressure may occur if you use thicker oil than what is recommended for your car. This should become apparent soon after an oil change, but as the oil ages, the issue will get worse. In any case, all you need to do is change your oil with the proper type and replace the oil filter, and you should be set to go. Faulty sending unit or gauge, to find the current oil pressure throughout your car, your engine uses sensors. However, you might believe that your oil pressure is high when it isn't if a sensor gives you a false reading or if the gauge you're looking at is broken. Faulty pressure relief valve, it doesn't follow that your engine won't reach a specific oil pressure just because you don't want it to. In order to redirect oil when the pressure becomes too high, the engine of your car has a pressure relief valve. However, oil pressure will continue to rise without any way out if this pressure relief valve is stuck closed. Blocked oil passages. Similar to how the oil filter can clog, dirt and other debris can accumulate in the engine's passageways and cause a blockage. There is no simple solution when this occurs. Although it's not a guarantee, you can try flushing the system several times to remove some of the dirt. Fortunately, if you maintain regular oil changes, this is not very common. Is high pressure bad for your engine? Of course, your engine will eventually be harmed by high oil pressure. Damage will occur more quickly at higher oil pressures. This is the reason it's critical to identify and fix a high oil pressure engine as soon as possible. If not, you might have to get a brand new engine and incur more costly repairs. Additionally, it's quite common for your oil pressure to increase when you accelerate. But remember that these jumps should remain within a normal range of operation and not be random. You should see a mechanic to find out what's going on if the oil pressure keeps rising when you accelerate, doesn't go back down, and rises outside of its normal operating range. Hope the information was helpful for you. If so, please press the like button and subscribe to the channel.